The worst thing you can do in youth ministry is become predictable. Like if your kids know what you say when you MC every time, those are your main verses, main thoughts. If they can predict the service every week, that's what will kill you in youth ministry. So I just find like I don't have passion. And I can't get it going. I'm going to I'm gonna pull up a little. Uh, by the way, Martin, I don't know if you guys saw that kid up here. He's fired. I remember three years ago at Jam when that kid started getting up and prophesying. And Carl pulled him up as a teenager. Carl's like, I might not be feeling this today, but this kid who's 14 years old, he's going to stir it up. He's going to flip the meeting. And that's not predictable. What's predictable is Carl doing this. So I think times as a youth pastor when I felt like, Oh man, I, I can't do it. I gotta call one of my guys or one of my teenagers and let's let them pray in that fresh voice. I don't know if you caught what I think Sharky, what he said. He's like, man, is it gonna be a new person preaching? Sometimes that new voice, maybe my voice has gotten old to my kids. They need to hear somebody different say it, even one of their peers, and that's what's gonna stir the crowd. Yeah.